welcome everyone today uh, we are going to see how we can add more than 16 rows or uh, for newer version more than 15 row in tableau in a tabular form so uh, tabular form is very important as most of the time end users want to see the raw data behind the visuals it's very easy in other tools like click view however not that straightforward in tableau in tableau you can extend the number of columns uh, to 50 after uh, after version 2019.4 and uh, before uh, i mean till 2019.3 uh, it was till 16 column that means till 2019.3 you can ex you can increase the number of columns uh, at max to 16 and now uh, after 2019.4 you can increase this till till 50 the second problem is that tableau uh, tableau's visuals need at least one measure for tabular chart else it will keep on showing the placeholder like abc so if in your requirement you want to increase the number of uh, columns more than 16 or more than 50 then we should tackle these two problems how we can increase the number of columns more than 50 and more than 16 so there is a small trick through which we will uh, increase the columns and numbers and also how uh, we will remove this abc placeholder without putting any uh, measure so let's see how we can tackle these two problems so uh, for for now what i have done that i have put in a lot of columns uh, in, in my visualization so you can see as soon as it becomes more than six it is start getting concatenated using comma so different different columns are getting concatenated and also at the very last there is always a abc value okay because i have not put it any measure so that's why this abc value is there okay also you can see there is a tool tip every time i hover on it there is always a tool tip so this sometimes become very uh, not so user friendly so that's why we need to remove this tooltip so first just just remove this tooltip i'm disabling it from here okay. now uh, we need to increase the size uh, by default it's six we can increase it till 16 because i'm using 2019.3 so i have a limit of 16 if you are using a higher version then you can increase it by uh, 50. so i need to go into analysis table layout and advance from here i can increase it to 16 beyond beyond 16 you will not able to increase tableau will not allow you to increase above 16. done let's make everything 16. Okay. so now you can see that my columns are not uh, are now not concatenated okay because i have less than 16 rows so what if i increase more uh, increase the columns beyond 16 so let's see what happens so i'm adding just adding few more columns to to it let me just expand the contents So as you can see, uh, I have added few more columns and a uh, few more dimensions and after that is, it just started getting concatenated. Okay. Now uh, I will put some measures as well here. So because in your raw data you want to show the measures as well. In measures you need to convert these measures into a discrete one because by default the measure will always have some aggregated functions attached to it like average of discount sum or profit 
so i need to make it discrete for uh, dimensions so that so that it can, we can get the individual values so now as you can see the uh, the columns gone beyond 16 and it started getting concatenated so how to tackle this situation uh, first let's let's just pull this thing into a dashboard because the sheet has a limitation that it cannot show more than this 16 columns so i need to and we cannot increase the the width and height of the sheet so but we can increase the width and height of the dashboard so i'll put pull it into a dashboard okay i'll name it as raw data so i will just increase it and let me put it automatic and if if your raw data sizes or your columns uh, column numbers are much larger then you can even increase the size instead of automatic you can increase the size because you will automatically get a scroll bar in a dashboard that you will not get a, get it into a sheet so let me just changes to fix size and then i'm increasing the width so you can see automatically there is a scroll bar and now every column is is showing perfectly okay let me increase it a bit so now the columns are coming properly there's two problem now first this abc placeholder and then there is this concatenation because it is not allowing to put more than 16 columns so to get rid of this situation what you have to do first you have to save the dashboard and then close the dashboard after that you have to open a notepad or a notepad plus plus any editor and just drag and drop this file this twb file into your notepad basically this twb file is nothing just just an xml coding so i'll just put it over here so you can see that it's being opened into an uh, xml form okay now you can see different type of information here i'll take some another video to explain about this there's a lot of information in xml file and we can use this xml file in many ways so focusing on our requirement we have to find attr column or better search for a row so So here you can see you need to search for this particular attribute equals to row level or you can search for the row levels or column levels that will help you to find your uh, locate to find this location easily so you can see at this particular uh, here the attributes are set to be 16 which we have set through uh, advanced options advanced table layout options so simply we have to increase this size okay now i'm increasing this size by 30 if you want if you want to increase it by 100 150 it's up to you you can increase it as much as you want so for me 30 is sufficient so i'm just adding it 30 30 and 30. so basically tableau is not allowing us to change but we are able to change it through an xml file through its background file so after this just save it and close it just open the workbook again okay. 
now my file is open if i scroll it you can see automatically these rows got separated you can see automatically that concaten concatenation is removed now and we have our raw data now the only thing is this abc we need to remove this abc placeholder okay so let's just remove this abc placeholder and our raw data will be ready I'm going back to sheet so in the sheet you will not able to see that abc so every time you have to, uh, if you want to have a preview you need to go into the raw data so basically i'm changing this thing just marker from text to polygon okay so now if you go onto your raw data you can see that as soon as you have changed it to the polygon uh, this abc is hidden now okay after that you just need to resize it as small make it as small as possible so now you can see that it's hidden okay it's showing like a normal tabular chart okay there is no visualization over here okay so if i increase the size So as you can see that uh, once I have minimized these, then I can see a small box here and I want to get completely rid of it. So what I can do, I'll, I had a small trick to remove this small box altogether. We need to go into sheet again. From the sheet, you need to go into the formatting worksheet and So format and format the border. Go into the columns. Go for the column driver. And set pane as none. Now go back and you can see that this is completely gone now. So it doesn't matter what's your uh, column sizes. This will, this small box will never come. So now we got rid of both the concatenation as well and the placeholder as well. Now you can uh, arrange your column size as per your requirement. So that's it. Thank you for watching.